This episode of what this episode of What's the Ads is brought to you by Full Sail University. Well, hello there, folks. It's John Q here from Techno Buffalo. Hope you guys are doing peachy. It's really, really hot outside today, and coincidentally, it's really, really hot in here as well. I don't have my AC running. I don't have my fans running, or else you hear a loud whirring sound when I'm recording this video. I'm sweating right now. Welcome to another episode of What's the App. Today, we're gonna get our audio on with an app called Airphones. Hit me. Yep, definitely, definitely not pretty. I'm itchy too, geez. Airphones is a nifty little application that allows you to stream your desktop's audio onto your iOS device over Wi-Fi. And that's about it, really. It has a very simple UI with only two real controls, volume and turning the thing on and off. The main reason why I decided to check out this application was because of mobility. Now, I use my headphones pretty often when I'm on my computer, so anytime I need to venture off my computer to, say, go to the washroom, head on down to the kitchen, or go outside to punish nature by frolicking with woodland creatures and so on, I need to disconnect my headphones and reconnect my headphones onto my computer every single time and if you make these trips often it does get really really annoying and you know frolicking doesn't happen itself airphones really does work and it's really nifty to be able to hear stuff like conference calls while walking about in the house but the app itself is really temperamental firstly the app doesn't natively support Mac OS lion so you got to do some tweaks to get it running it's a pretty simple procedure which I followed from this guy you'll be able to check out his video from airphones website or from his YouTube channel secondly it doesn't stream all audio sources from your computer. No matter what I tried, I couldn't stream audio from Adobe Premiere Pro. I've tried changing the audio output settings, fiddling and faddling with whatnots and who's it, but that just made things worse, resulting in several reboots to get earphones working properly again. And most importantly, although the audio does stream relatively in real time, it cuts out every now and then. The quality isn't 100%, which I guess isn't too bad, but having blips of silence when you're jamming to your favorite songs just isn't fun. Just some background here. Similar, better built, and more popular computer to iDevice audio streaming solutions are out there, such as Airfloat and Airfoil. However, these apps have recently been taken down from the App Store, and unfortunately, I never got a chance to test or use them. There's a lot of speculation that the apps have been removed because a broader range of AirPlay streaming is going to be natively integrated into iOS 6. Makes sense, I guess. We'll just have to wait and see. And speaking of iOS, I'm gonna take some time to thank our friends at Full Sail University. You guys and I both know that the mobile app industry is on fire right now, okay? Full Sail University's online mobile development bachelor's degree program can help teach you the skill sets you need to take advantage of those emerging opportunities. In this degree, you'll learn both the programming and business side of mobile development so that you can concept, develop, deploy, and market an application from start to finish. You'll explore advanced programming languages, visual frameworks, usability principles, and app deployment for both iOS and Android. Through Full Sail's Project Launchbox program, students receive a MacBook preloaded with industry software plus iOS and Android devices. Courses are delivered through Full Sail's immersive online education platform, which maximizes the capabilities of the Mac, giving you a learning experience unlike any other. 15, that's one five billion applications have been downloaded from the App Store, and Android's market share is expected to grow over 600% this year. If you're ready to master the technology and software to compete in this rapidly growing industry, visit fullsale.edu slash technobuffalo. Again, that's fullsale.edu slash technobuffalo to learn more about this online degree program. Back to the review. Overall, Airphone seems to be one of the last few remaining solutions to stream desktop audio onto your iDevices. The app is rather pricey, there's a lot that needs to be fixed, and with the potential promise of iOS 6's native AirPlay streaming on the horizon, Airphones just doesn't really seem to be worth it. 1.5 out of 5. If you're still looking to expand your iOS streaming experience, check out AirServer. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my review of Airphones. This was John Q from Techno Buffalo. Thank you very much for stopping by, and I'll see you guys next time. Laters! I'm sweating. <laughs>